I have come to the conclusion that for the most part, when it comes to jobs, to most workplaces and our experiences with workplaces, after you're there for a set amount of time, I genuinely believe this is a common thing. Now, I haven't worked corporate or nothing or like fast food, but I believe it's not the job itself that sucks, but rather the environment and coworkers. It's it's the people. It can actually take a toll. It can genuinely change your trajectory. It will infiltrate your mind. It, like other people, they're going to influence. If they have no control over their influence and they're just spouting out, they're wanting everyone to be negative like them and such, or the way they complain about everything, it'll just rub off on you. It's something to battle. And I'm having challenges with this. Like, I'm so... I get so... I try not to be, and I'm just there sitting, trying to maintain psychological and mental homeostasis, like constant complaining, and it's just right there in front of me. And I do landscape, and by the way, like I, I don't care about the work. The work is the work. The only thing that's like, I necessarily hate is just picking up trash after other people because i'm there to cut grass and like do all this stuff but like people throwing trash out their cars on the road so that's the one thing but it's really when it comes to this it is just defending my mind i don't want to be around that no one wants to be around that In the way this video I'm complaining and literally like showing it, that's funny. It comes full circle, but like I need to address this. Guard your mind in your workplace. If you are still in school, oh my goodness. Get you it's very necessary to get some noise canceling earbuds. I remember junior year, first day on the bus ride, it pissed me off. All the Bro, a bus ride is a bus ride. I, I mean, it's high school, a public high school, and like I jumped the gun and spent two fifty on AirPod Maxes, not AirPod Maxes. What am I saying? AirPod Pros. It was a worthy investment. I could have done better. Like, I got these off Amazon for like forty bucks. Basically, same thing, same quality. Be careful with what. Listen, what uh, music you're listening to? Turn these like opportunities of like where you're just working. Either have the noise canceling headphones and get in a flow state. Now there's this I don't know what to call this state, but but eventually you'll do an action and it becomes autopilot and you just become in your head. And this is something super common with like physical work, physical labor, and. Use that to like, you can visualize, you can work through stuff. It's a pretty special moment and state to be in. So, obviously I believe in like, a bit of music, sure, of course, but podcast. And just nothing at all. Just you with you. And that... That's honestly lost in this world. So, I don't know where this video went. But hopefully, I like gave you some insight on some stuff. Maybe um, become more aware and help you battle these inevitable environments. Because I'm in this come-up stage, and this is where I get my capital for e-commerce. Which, uh, I honestly strongly believe, like, If not, this is the last year. It's going to be sooner than the end of the season. Like, I I just don't want to be around that. Influences, inputs. It's negative. It brings me down. 
It just, I don't want to be around that. We can only change ourselves. Best we can do is to do our best and um, transition. If you in the grind of phase like me, it is what it is. We have to show up every single day. Do the work. Hold frame. Defend your mind. When these negative things happen, reinstill positive and like get in the word of God or go in a group call with like-minded people that aren't negative and lift you up. So, yeah, that's a little little video. I'm trying to go to sleep. See you in the next one. Love you, Jesus loves you. Peace.